Hey everybody and welcome to another spontaneous toy review. I'm your host Scott Zillner and this is Toy Wizards. That's toy-wizards.com and today's toy is Mr. T. Uh, Clubber Lang, B.A. Baracus, whatever you want to call him. He is the man with the metal necklace and attitude to go with it. This is the WWE Elite Comic Con version of, let's open them up, Mr. T. It's Mr. T. I mean, bam, Mr. T. This is an item that just completely sold out the moment it went up. It just went, oop, hey, it's up and gone. We were very lucky to get one. Looks like there's a, uh... oh, well, that's nice. You don't have to really uh, destroy the packaging to get them out. I was like, man, I don't want to open this, but I got to open it and bam. They just made my life a lot easier. Thank you. Thank you very much. He comes in a bookcase item. Says Mr. T in nice Mr. T lettering. This is from the old WWF, now called WWE. And the funny story behind that is they were trying to sue the World Wildlife Federation over the usage of WWF. Even though WWF World Wildlife had it before them and didn't bother them uh ww wrestling sued them lost the lawsuit and then had to change their name because of it so that was kind of hubris on the wrestling federations uh you know hey we tried to you know throw our weight around and they lost and that's why they call themselves wwe so there you go they do have the classic ww logo here but not the f because they're not allowed to use it anymore yeah so that's pretty neat. This is first time in the line, Mr. T. And I was really excited about this figure because he's got this jacket. Let's see if I can get him out of here. Well, that comes out pretty easy. Box is nice. It's in a second box. So it's like double box with a nice box. And then this just slides right out and it has a little protector. Fantastic packaging. Thank you. Thank you so much. This means you can take the thing out, you can put the thing back in the box, whatever you want to do with it. I want the figure out, so we're going to go ahead and bust him out. He does have extra hands, which is nice. There's never an easy way. Oh, there's ties? No. Yeah, there is. Hey, Think I'm untying him? Are you untied? Break free of those shackles. I hate twist ties. He's got some on his feet. Why would you put him on his feet? I don't understand this sometimes. I really don't. You don't need those ties in there at all. Come on. All right, we're free. That was much more stressful than I thought. I hate those things. All right, let's take a look at that figure. Now that we got the, the drama out of the way, he's still got ties stuck onto him. What I was saying is I liked... The fact that he came with his jacket and this is a you know camo jacket which means boom we've got an a-team da Baracus here and that's really why i wanted my this figure i wanted a ba Baracus. um it'd be nice if he had some some you know wasn't just wearing wrestling trunks in the battle but hey are you gonna tell ba Baracus what you want him to do no you don't you just let him do what he wants. Big jewelry thing that will come off. Uh, obviously, his soft goods will come off. He's got a gauntlet on that side and a wrist bracelet on that side, which is neat. Um, does the, the soft goods kind of make his jewelry kind of come up into his head a little bit, but that's all right. Lots of rings on one finger. That's neat. This is a great figure. It's been a long time since we've had some Mr. T stuff. Uh, we're also going to see Mr. T in WW Eternia figures. That's coming up on Wave 4, so bam, you know, Mr. T signed back up with his likeness with the WWE, and he's getting some love, and I'm I'm loving it, you know? I wonder if I could grab my G.I. Joe. Let's see. Yes. So... Here he is in, uh, you know, G.I. Joe perspective. He could easily join your Joe team. Right, Mr. T? 
I pity the fool. He doesn't fight Cobra. There we go. <laughs> yes. Um, do you need a gun? I'm just going to punch people. Oh, all right. There we go. Done and done. So, he is obviously the elite body scale. I'm going to get rid of some of this stuff and let's see what he is underneath. Uh, Mr. T, I'm going to undress you a little bit here. Uh, don't take offense. Belt comes off relatively easy. Got all of his uh, necklaces. Those also come off real easy. Jacket is Velcro? We're finding out. Yep, yeah, Velcro. That's great. Boom. All right, now he's ready to fight. He's got full-on skin underneath. Um, gauntlet will have to come off. Gauntlet just pulls right off. I always try not to pull these things too much because I, I, I don't want them to fly off into the wilderness. All right, let's get that jacket off. Are you ready to fight? He's going to go into combat. He doesn't need that jacket. What's funny is this jacket really looks like the jacket that came with the uh, the old B.A. Baracus action figure. So that's kind of neat that he gets that similar jacket. So, boom. Put that gauntlet back on. I like the gauntlet. That's a nice little touch. It's a nice touch. Can we get it on? There we go. And your necklaces. Boom. All right. Again, this is a fabulous figure. This is really nice. He looks nice. It's great to see Mr. T back in toy form. It's been a while. Um, the face sculpt is nice. He's definitely got his angry face on. And uh, boom, he's ready to wrestle. He's ready to fight with some Joes. Whatever you want to do, this B.A. Baracus, Mr. T, Clubber Lang, anything you want to call him, he's ready to go and do it in style. Now, this is the Elite Comic-Con version of this figure. There will be another figure of him later on down the line. It won't be so hard to get or it's that expensive. This was very expensive for this soft good jacket that I needed so I can make him part of my A-Team. So... There we go. That's why I needed that figure. <laughs> I, I really, I, I wasn't going to get him because he's a wrestling figure. I was going to get him so I can make him part of an A-team and go with off with my G.I. Joes. So it's a very nice figure. It scales right. It's got extra hands in the packaging. Um, the jacket fits nice on him. You can definitely switch out the giant Mr. T belt for, you know, a little ammo belt or something like that if you want. And uh, he's ready to go. He's got the slim body for the wrestling. Some of them are slim, some are thick. This is a nice body on him. And it works out really well. Can I pop the head off? Let's try. No, I'm not really pulling that head off like you can with the Joes. You probably can. I refuse to break it. That's sorry, buddy. Maybe you pop off, maybe you don't. I'm not going to take the chance. You're not doing it right. It's not. Nope. No. Nope. Now he's loose. Now his head's loose. I'm gonna push him back. I think he's got the double. He's got the double uh, ball ball for the uh, necks, and now his necks a little loose. I'm gonna have to try to fix that. That's what I get I'm trying to be customizing in here. Oh man. You're gonna be all right. I'll be fine. All right. Good. We're good. These guys were sold by Entertainment Earth, and they are completely gone. You're going to have to go on eBay if you want to get a hold of one of these Mr. T figures. And I pity the fool that has to pay those eBay prices. I'm sorry. Anything else, else to say? Don't like flying. Nobody does. No one does. See you guys.